wa kullu bidatun dalala wa kullu dalalatin fin nar wa bad qala tabarak ta'ala wa ma khalaqtu al jinna wal insa illa liya'budun that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the english rendering that we have not created the jinn and mankind except to establish our worship and yesterday and this past month of ramadan allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have given the muslim this great opportunity to establish this ayah but this ayah its meaning goes beyond the month of ramadan that we the human being we mankind male and female that we are created for a purpose so when allah subhanahu wa ta'ala he created mankind he had intending for us to fulfill a purpose and an objective and this objective as outlined in this ayah illa liya'budun except to establish the worship of allah so this is the objective this is the purpose of us human being that is on this earth to establish the worship of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to establish the tawhid of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala the oneness of allah to establish the taha the obedience of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in all forms and ways as outlined by allah and his rasul ali sallallahu alaihi wasallam so this is our objective so ramadan we were given this opportunity to establish this ayah to establish the worship and the obedience of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so in this month of ramadan we were and we were involved in many aspect of the main pillars of islam we established siyam which is a the fasting a pillar of islam also al qiyam the worship in salah the normal salat and also the additional salat that we established in the masjid also in ramadan we established zakah so most also charity so the muslim in the month of ramadan we had the opportunity to establish this ibad of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala but we are not to stop there meeting after ramadan or after ramadan we have to continue in establishing this ayah ma khalaqtu al jinn wal ins illa liya'budun we have not created you mankind and the jinn except for this purpose and this objective which is to worship allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so the muslim we have to reflect on the things that we had established in Ramadan and continue in establishing these things after Ramadan and inshallah in the upcoming Ramadan so do not limit this worship of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala only to the month of Ramadan but be consistent and persistent in establishing of our religion and this religion of Islam is the religion the way that we have been given to establish this ibadah of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so after we uh, we have been told of the purpose of our existence we were given the blueprint to uh, to establish the worship of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and this blueprint this manual of establishing the worship of Allah it is the Quran and the Sunnah and in one word Islam so the way of worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala it must be done by way of Islam so this is the religion this is the way of life that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have given mankind not just the muslim but mankind to establish this religion of islam a religion that establish and encourages and command everything which is good and beneficial for you the individual and also for the community at large and also islam it forbids those things which is harmful and dangerous to us the individuals and also the community at large our religion establishes justice wa ja'alnakum ummatan wasata that we have made you a umma a nation which is wasat so islam is a balanced way islam is the way of life that allah subhanahu wa ta'ala have chosen for mankind to follow that we have chosen and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is pleased for you to follow Islam as your way of life a deen in the Allah al-Islam the religion with Allah it is Islam so Islam is something which is a part of our life whether inside the masjid or in our homes or in the streets